Hello dear friends welcome back to the android programming in this session we are going to understand how can we perform a simple animation using android such as fade in fade out zoom in zoom out rotate how can we apply such animation effect on image view in android we are going to design a simple image view and we are going to apply such animation effect on the image view so let's understand how to do it so i have added here a simple project of category empty activity in android studio first i'm going to design a simple image view on activity main.xml so i'm going to change the layout of this xml file as then i'm going to remove the default text box which is there in the project once i decided to use the linear layout i need to specify the orientation attribute of this layout i am using the vertical orientation then i am going to design a simple image view here so to design the image view there is a image view tag i am specifying the width to this image view as 300 dp and the height to this image view as 300 dp then i need to specify the id to this image view so here i am specifying the id as image 1 image 1 then i want to design the a different buttons to apply the animation on this image view so i'm designing the first button and specifying the width as 300 dp then height as wrap content then text as fade in fade in and then id as ptn fade in okay so id should begins with at the rate plus id slash fade in btn fade in like that id i want to specify after this i want to design the same button again so i have copy this and i am changing the id to this button fade out is is the id that i am going to specify then again i want to create a same button for zoom in again i am creating the same button for rotate effect and to the click listener of this button i am going to add the on click function of function 1 the first function to the first button and uh, function 2 to the second button and uh, function 3 to the second third button and function 4 to the fourth button so we need to define this function to create the function for this i am going to choose this create function in main activity option so function 1 will automatically add it there i can copy the same function again to create a function 2 then i am going to create a function 3 for button 3 and then i'm going to create a function 4 for button 4 so these are the four button that i have designed and these are the func click listener of this function the click listener of these buttons now i need to create the animation file for this for applying the animation effect applying such animation effect on button so for that i am moving towards the resource folder 
I'm expanding the resource folder and inside the drawable folder. Inside the resource folder, I'm going to create a new folder, resource directory. So for that, I have right click on it and choosing the Android resource directory and then getting selecting the resource type as transition and specifying the name to the directory as anim you can specify any valid name to your directory such as animation my animation etc and the resource type must be selected as transition to specify or to put the animation file inside this folder so after this i am going to click on ok so inside this animation folder i want to add the animation file so once i right click on animation folder i can get this option animation resource file and i am giving the name to this animation file as fade in and i am going to click on ok the code for the fade in animation effect that i have already copied from internet so this is the sample code for applying the fade in effect so i am simply making copy of the same code here okay this is the code for fade in effect now similar to that i am going to create one more animation resource file and uh, want to provide the name to this file as fade out okay again i'm copying this code for this fade out effect that i have downloaded from internet okay then again i'm going to create a fourth file as animation resource file and the fourth file that i want to create is bling or zoom in zoom in and the code for the zoom in i am going to copy that code inside this file and the last file i want to create is rotate and again i am adding the rotation code inside this file so here is the rotation code after that i can move over the main activity dot java first i need to create the object of animation class for applying the animation on image view there is the animation class i have created the object as animation then i need to initialize the image view that is designed in xml so i have created the object of image view then we need to specify the image to this image view so for specifying the image to this image view we need to use the source attribute and in front of source attribute we need to specify the name of the image file the simple image file that i am going to copy from my d drive so here is the sample image named drs that i am going to copy inside this drawable folder and i'm specifying the specifying this file as a source of this image view drawable drs now you can see the design the designs is look like this you can add this design at the center of your screen by applying the center gravity layout gravity in this way we can specify the image view at the center of your screen and the same attribute i am going to specify for the 
all the buttons that is designed here okay in this way this designs look like then i want to change the text of this button also so i have created the button fade in then fade out then zoom in and finally the rotate okay so now these buttons and design look like this now i can move over the code in main activity.java so i have created the animation object and image view object then we need to initialize the image view first so we can initialize the image view by using find view by id function and we need to specify the id to this function so id is image 1 then then i am going to initialize this animation object using the animation utils is a predefined class from this i am going to call the load function and this function require the context context i am specifying this and i am going to specify the animation resource file which is there in animation folder anim dot fade in to the first button i have designed this i have defined this function one and inside this function one i am accessing this fade in file okay and then i am going to specify this i am going to call the set animation function and passing the animation object to this function so the same code we need to write for all other button so i am going to copy the same code and only changing the name of the animation file so second file is fade out and the third file is zoom in r dot anim dot zoom in and the fourth file is rotate okay so now we can check for the output with the so there is one mistake in this application instead of this set animation function we need to call the start animation function start animation and we need to pass the animation object to this okay i am making the copy of same line for all the four functions now we can check for the output so after execution of this here is the output of this application now we can check for the each effect whether it is working or not i am going to click on this fade in button now it shows the fade in effect now fade out is also working zoom in is also working and rotate is also working so in this way we can apply the animation effect to the image view in android i hope you understand thank you